While the investigation into what went wrong continues, family members of the homeowners say this all started when the dryer caught fire. 41 Actions investigator Jessica McMaster looks at what you can do to keep your home safe and just dryer fires are not all that uncommon. No, not at all. In fact, dryer fires account for roughly 15,000 house fires every year. The number one cause of them catching fire, not cleaning the hidden areas of your dryer. Keeping your home safe from dryer fires goes beyond cleaning the lint trap. It involves looking at the parts you can't see at a glance. The Fire Prevention Association shows us how quickly the flames can spread when lint builds up in the vent. And we're going to end up catching the clothes on fire outside the dryer. You can see the change in the room. Clothes are going to catch. And we're going to go to an untenable situation in here in a few minutes. Robert Berry works to prevent dryer fires. On occasion, we'll even find charred lint in a system where a fire attempted to engage. Berry's business, Full Service Chimney, professionally cleans dryer vents. Berry says the whole system needs to be cleaned every 12 to 24 months. Signs you're in danger are clothes taking too long to dry. The dryer gets extra hot and a burning smell near the dryer. If a fire does start, it's often concealed while it spreads throughout the house. Whether it be an attic, a floor, and a wall, so the fire has time and opportunity to gain a foothold before being observed. It costs about $200 to $400 to have a system professionally cleaned. And again, ideally, you should have that done every 12 to 24 months. I'm investigator Jessica McMaster, 41 Action News. And Jess, the National Fire Protection Association tracks deaths of firefighters who die on the job. In 2018, the group tallied 64 firefighter deaths nationwide. It's an improvement from years past. 10 years prior, 106 firefighters lost their lives. Falls, by the way, one of the least common deaths for on-duty firefighters. In 2018, 3% of on-duty deaths were contributed to falling. Nearly half that year were because of overexertion, stress, or medical issues.